That's awesome. I can remember that now, and I've got it on the internet to help me with this video. It's absolutely ridiculous. And I like this bus. Now, can anybody tell me why this guy came back in, in Sonic, Sonic Generations? <laughs> Dean Bristow, you absolute monster, madman. Team Blast whenever you're getting close. Don't go too close, of course, because when you come out of it, you might, uh... And I've used that, uh, pole before, and I've actually gotten taken out in the air while using that pole, too, so... <laughs> I'm not going to use it. I don't care. If it gives me another speed option, look, look, like that. Does something like that. <laughs> this is why that boss, the, this boss kind of annoys me because of that, but, you know, let it, let the boss move forward before it does a lot of its attacks. No, Sonic, I don't want to, I don't want to hit that. I got it anyway. That's nice. Ow, oh, and if you get too far back, he does the charge attack. Now I'm gonna let him go up, because I don't want to be hit by that. Shield. I do like the theme for this though, it kind of fits. Or just hit the center, that's, that's the easy way of doing it. <laughs> Dummy rings! Yeah! Take this, take this. Level three. Almost went too far back. And I rightfully deserve that. Oh, and look what I am, level 3 Knuckles. Time to destroy everything. Get, like I said, get in right up close. Team Blast away, whenever you get the meter back, just uh... Oh, 
a lot of Dean Bristow's work here. Yeah. I, I, I know this is his last game and he really did a great job. I thought I didn't make the uh, jump there. Final team blast to go in the middle. And I believe this might finish him off. No, still got a little bit of health left. Go, Knuckles. There he is. He's down. And that's the end of Sonic Heroes. Alright! That one would have hurt. Defeated. Impossible. The three of us are unstoppable. Now that is not that bad. B rank at this time, <laughs> at this stage, yeah, pretty damn good. And Thirty-nine emblems. Oh my god. Final cutscene time, this is uh, Sonic, Team Sonic's ending cutscene, of course. I know, uh, right? Night of the Last Day. With... Now, the, the models do look a little bit rubbery. Is with the rubber, with the, uh, yeah, the rubber, <laughs> with the lighting there, but, um, they're pretty good models, like, I gotta say, for the, for the, for the time this game out, they're pretty great models. Um, this is the end of Sonic Heroes, that's it, that's Team Sonic. Well, I finished the game with Team Sonic, so that, that means that I see the Team Sonic, uh, ending credits, and it's a perfect song here. I gotta remember what the song's called. It's never as hard as it seems. Some people could say, yeah, it'd be so much better than Alarm, but it's not. It's not the name of the song. Weekend. That's the one. Good job, Wave Master. You did Sonic Advance 3 soundtrack, and then you did this one, and I, I really give you thumbs up for that, because... The, the soundtrack, for the most part, in this in this game, is probably one of the best things about this game specifically. There are a lot of tracks here that I can really say, yes, I've got on my iPhone, and I listen to them like a lot. There's Shadow. I've seen that cutscene anyway. But yeah, that's Sonic Heroes. I gotta say, it's one of my favorite Sonic games ever. My first 3D Sonic game, and when I did finish it, I felt really, really happy about it. I mean, I played it 
Team Sonic, of course, at first, and then did Team Rose, I believe, next, I think, and then Team Dark? I don't know. I don't know, I can't remember exactly how I initially tackled this game, but I've got to say, I really do enjoy this game, because, like, the soundtrack's great, some of the level design is pretty good, yeah, there's a few problems here and there, but... I'm gonna say the team-based gameplay isn't a, wasn't a bad attempt because it made it stick out from a lot of the other Sonic games and still does to this day. And I think it's a gimmick that they should go back on because like Sonic Advance 3, even though some of the level design in that is crap, uh, did really well um, with the team-based gameplay of two members of the same team. And then this game with three three members rather than two, and they say try another story, and that's if you finish off all the stories and everything like that, and just show another cutscene. And then it always says saying, "Yep, you've done 100 percent of that team," which it will say on the bottom of the screen under Team Sonic's option. If it will go, there you go. See, a hundred, and I haven't even played Team Chaotix yet. Which is what I'm going to get to in just a few minutes. So anyway, thanks you guys so much for watching the main playthrough of Sonic Heroes. We have got one more episode of the main playthrough, and then Chaotix will take a uh, will take a little bit of a break. I don't think we might take a break that long between the final story and then playing Team Chaotix gameplay because I'll make that a separate. LP altogether because Team Chaotix is uh, is mission based. So whereas Team Sonic, Team Dark, and Team Rose are pretty much the same as each other, except on different difficulties, of course, and level level length, level one. <laughs> so anyway, thank you guys so much for watching the main LP of Sonic Heroes. I know this was a bit unorthodox to how people play it because they play each team's gameplay separately. But I thought just to make it a lot easier just to see all the stages so you don't have to see them like four times by the end of the Chaotix playthrough, um, that you get bored. So I thought I'd better change it up a little bit and do a little bit of an orthodox thing. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. There is one final episode and that will be featuring the last story segment which I can't go over to yet. Actually, let me show that off right now. If I can. Go into my... Main... See, this is here. And that's when you beat the game with other teams. Uh, but if you go up here, so 100%. There's a last story segment. But I need the 7 Chaos Emeralds. So I won't be playing it, but I will be sharing someone else's gameplay of it, and hopefully giving my commentary over the video, because I, don't, I can't get all the 7 Chaos Emeralds on this. I've tried my best, and I've only got apparently 2 Chaos Emeralds in this uh, save file as well, my main save file, so yeah. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, you guys have a great day and night, thanks for watching the LP of Sonic Heroes, and of course, take care.